What up, y'all? So, back again. My boy just showed up with his uh, new Camaro. This is 2019 with uh, just a muffler delete right now, but sound real good. So yeah, new logo. But yeah, we just put a, uh, did a sub install in here, so pretty cool. Uh, not as bad as you would think it is to do. But yeah, it's uh, the center console has to come up for you to get your remote wire. So that's the that's the only out of the ordinary thing in here. So the little leather part right here, I just kind of grab it towards the front and you push it up. So once you get that up, then it's two 10 millimeter bolts in here. And it's another 10 millimeter bolt back here which I think I took some pictures while I was doing it. But once you get all of that out, same on the other side, you lift this up and the cigarette lighter right there, that's gonna be your remote turn on. So that's only on when the car is actually on or whatever. So that's where you get your remote wire from. And as you can tell, the console and the seat touch. So running the wire to the back, all you gotta do is lift the seat up, wire goes straight under. No problem hiding it. Uh, seat pretty much comes up like every other Camaro seat or whatever. Impala just lift up real hard. Uh, it's, it's one push-in thing right here on each side. So it's a little tough, but once you pop that up, the whole seat is up. And yeah, it's no problem. And of course, you know, tap into the wires, the speaker wires in here. But Basically, it's two wires. Uh, it's a green wire on green wire is ground. Then whatever color the other wire is is positive. Uh, the left side, the right side, two different colors. But green is on both sides, and that'll be your ground wire. But everything else is just straightforward. Uh, batteries in the trunk, so nothing, nothing out of the ordinary for hooking that up. But uh, yeah, let's uh. Let's see what the LT1 looked like. Hadn't seen one of these in a minute outside of my other homeboy. It just got a red 2020, so I put that in here too. So yeah, what y'all think about these, man? I'm uh, I really want a new car now. Like, everybody uh, leveling up on me, so it might be time for the C5 to go. I'm not getting a Camaro, though, but it might be time to get something else. Still trying to decide, but yeah, what y'all think? I am, hood vent is actually functional on these, so just in case you didn't know. Flow tie. So, what y'all think on this? Let me turn this off. There we go. But yeah. Let me know what y'all think.
Yep.